Hello everyone, my name is Piao and I'm a relationship specialist with Desert Financial and I've been with this amazing company for five years. And today I'm here to talk about five challenges that's going to help you reach your financial goals. And these challenges are really going to help you build some healthy savings habits. So the first challenge that I have here for you is going to be what's called the 52 week challenge. So what that means is that the first week of this challenge, you're going to save a dollar. And then the second week, you're going to save $2. And then the third week, you're going to save $3 and then so on and so forth. And so at the end of the year, you're going to be able to save almost $5,000. So if you do this for a couple years, that's really going to help you with like a down payment on a mortgage for like your family, or if you just want to consolidate debt. And so that brings on to my next challenge that I have here for you, challenge number two. What that one's called is going to be the $5 challenge. So what that means is that anytime you pay for something and you get $5 back, you just tuck it away into a jar or something and it's gonna be out of sight, out of mind. So the nice thing about that one is it's good for, you know, emergencies. You can just have that peace of mind that you have a little stash away so that way you won't have to stress about anything in life. And who knows, maybe it might uplift your mood at the end of the day. Be like, yay, have extra money. So that would be exciting. So that's a good challenge to have. And then the third challenge that I want to talk about is going to be what's called the dollar a day challenge. And so what that one's going to entail is that every day you're going to save up a dollar. And then at the end of the year, you have a nice little fun that's going to help you save up for those maybe smaller financial goals in life. Like maybe you're looking to get your TV fixed. Maybe you're looking to get your car fixed. You'll be able to have that flexibility of an extra savings account to help you with those unfortunate or unforetold events in life. So that's really going to be helpful there. And then the fourth challenge that I have here for you is going to be uh, basically the rounding up change challenge. So what that one's going to be about is basically every time that you purchase something, if you round up to the nearest dollar and maybe transfer it through online banking manually into a separate account, that's going to really add up. Or if you set up an account at an institution that offers automatically transferring your purchases, rounding up to the nearest dollar. That's also another option for you. And you know, one time I actually just, uh, I had a member that they gave me about $900 and it was just in coins. And they told me it took about a year for them to save up for it. So coins can add up to a lot. So you can't really underestimate the power of them. So. That's the fourth challenge. And then the last challenge I have for you, which is going to be my favorite, this is going to be the direct deposit challenge. So this is going to be the easy, no hassle way to save you money. So you always just have, you know, maybe a set amount, like maybe $10, maybe $20, whatever you're comfortable with. You just have your direct deposit split at another account. So it's out of sight, out of mind, and you don't touch it until you, of course, you need it like for emergencies or if you want to do something fun or if you want to consolidate debt or put money down on a house, whatever you plan on doing with the fun, it's going to be nice knowing that it's all there, a little nest for you with that direct deposit. And so, well, that brings me to all five challenges. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you liked the video and give it a thumbs up. You have a great rest of your day.